So it starts with a scrum on the right hand side and the ball goes from 9 to 10 and then you've got 12 and 13 running at identical lines very tight and also at a lot of speed and when we start to play the video you can see why this is important very hard very fast tight line that takes their opposite defenders interest so they have to bite onto them but critically it brings the 13 defense in tight as well and now he's out the game and that means there's space on a slight edge what the all blacks are trying to get with mckenzie who is now running a loop line so he's following his pass He's on the loop and he's trying to exploit that space which has been created from the two centers running those tight lines. So a beautiful pass and you can just see there how tight it is. All three defenders are now out of the game. That's just enough of a gap for McKenzie's pace to break through and go through. And when we watch it from behind, you can see how narrow the defense gets because of the attacking running line. So it doesn't look like there's anything special going on, but it's the time and it's the pace and it's how they create that space, which is really important. And then they get their man with the gas on the outside and then it feeds it just at the perfect time. No one's going to touch Barrett there. An absolutely beautiful try from the All Blacks from Scrum Starter Play.